We haven't even gone over there yet. Look at all these VR critters <laughs> running around. Everyone jump in front of the logo, and we want to say hi to you. <laughs> it's like how they all scramble. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Slow night today. <laughs> well, I think there's a convention. There's four conventions going on. There's your reference, Philadelphia. Furry Delphia? Yeah. Um, feral? Feral? Yeah. And is, is that no, 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 not Feral. feral? Um, it's IFC this weekend. Oh. Maybe that's where and there's Comic Cons going on. Like, uh, Babs just went to a con up in uh, Canada. And when is um and, and uh, when is the D23? That's next weekend, isn't it? Well, let's find out. D23 is Labor Day weekend. weekend? Oh, MFM's next weekend. Wow. MFM? No, yeah, MFM. Um, actually, yeah, yes, MFM. MFM. it's not next week. It's the week after. Oh, they're not doing it Labor Day this year? Nope, it's Friday, September 9th through Sunday, oh, September 9th. Oh, they moved it. That's one? weird. For which one? For D D23. D23. Oh, D23. Oh, D23. I thought you were talking about MFM. Oh, oh. And I, I'll look, but I don't think they changed. Yeah, MFM is like always Labor Day weekend. And then next weekend here in Orlando, um, there is Fanboy Con. So the Toxie and I are going to go check that out and take some photos. And yeah, Yappy's right. MFM is next week. Sorry, Fanboy Expo. It's Fanboy and Expo. We will not be on the air September 9th to 11th. Right. We're taking a little break. We're going to have one week off. Um, Yappy and I are going to go hit uh, a, a, a North Carolina. So if you're in North Carolina, please wave because we'll be in there. Maybe we'll see you. What you doing? Oh, that's right. Dragon Con's next weekend. That's right. Dragon Con is next weekend. Yeah. You going so camping? Um. No, we're going to go visit a park called the Wizard Land of Oz. It's a theme park that's only open for three weekends a year. Oh, it's wow. It's very curious, and it gets really high reviews. It's super hard to get into because it sells out instantly. We got tickets. So we're going mm -hmm. to go check out a very mysterious theme park, the Land of Oz. It's up on the top of a mountain. It actually looks really cool, and apparently the actors nail it. So we're going to see what it's all about. Very cool. Yeah. And yeah, Furry Badass, she did post a picture of her with Brent Spiner today. Who did? Uh, Babs. Oh. Nice. <laughs> and who's Brent Spiner? He uh, played, he Data? played Data on The Next Generation. Okay. Oh, oh. you. she had a thing for him, didn't she? Oh, God, yes. Oh, okay. She still does. <laughs> okay. <laughs> she still does. <laughs> How are I, you? I get it. I get it. I'd suck his dick. That, Whoa! Yeah, what? You know what? Why it's not? all pale. No, it's all makeup. <laughs> You're going to get makeup all over your now. <laughs> That's fine. He is fully functional. <laughs> Does he put it down there too? Does he put the makeup down there to ask him? I'm pretty sure he does. Oh, LeVar Burton was in the background of that photo? Brett, I want to know yeah. where does the makeup end? The LeVar basically photobombed. <laughs> Sorry. I love LeVar cool. Burton. Yeah. Oh, God, yes. I just saw him in an episode of uh, The Big Bang Theory today. Oh, I, really? I am curious why it's snowing in the lounge today. Oh, I love The Big Bang Theory. Oh, no, that's snow. That's it's, not snow. That's flowers. flowers. Oh. Those are, um... It's just like... Uh, uh, it's just like go fast. They're cherry blossoms. Booba, did you add this, or is this a person's avatar? <laughs> he has no idea. I didn't do it. He was just like, oh, <laughs> shit, I didn't know those trees pollinated. Yes. Yes, Fred. Hey, hey, hey Fred. I now we're going to be working at a tech company, so now if I could actually oh, no. make uh, your phone show Yappy phoning, and it'd be calling from me. That's creepy. Okay. Through his number. Okay. A number now. Sure. Uh, who gave him this much power? I mean, it's not that hard, to be honest. <laughs> I'll just call the FCC and block hey, Canada. Do we want to do a... You guys want to do a couple quick rounds? Only a couple quick rounds of Why Am I Fat? Because I've got a couple extras. Who lined up? Everyone line up on the ground. We're going to go left to right. Line up on, line up across the, the logo. Line up across the logo, guys. We're going to ask you a few good questions. But seriously, why, who's... Uh... Oh, excuse me. Actually, no, we, can, we can do the floor. We can do the um, uh, A and B. We can do A and B. Who is making the pedals? Is that a person chain or is it like a uh the world? Okay, it's you. Cool. We're gonna have you just stay in the world forever now. You're now a part of our background. All right, so this is what we're gonna do. We're gonna do a few quick rounds. Uh, we got some some part two of Why Am I Fats for you guys because we want you to play along too. All right, now we're gonna see, simply tell me if it's more or less than the number I'm giving you, okay? 
only more or less than the number I'm giving you. And this is for a Buffalo Wild mm -hmm. Wing cheese curd bacon burger. Don't, don't listen to him. He's Buffalo lying. Wild Wing cheese curd bacon burger. Is it more or less than 1,500 calories? Is it more or less than 1,500 calories? What is that? For the Wild Wing, Buffalo Wild Wings cheese curd bacon burger. So A for less, B for more. A for less, B for more than 1,500 calories. Are you guys seeing this? Seeing what? What are we uh, seeing? I feel like we're staring at the edge of the universe. Oh, look at that, look at that. The orb. What are you talking about? The event oh. horizon. Oh, okay. I All right. Like with those ingredients, it would be slightly more. Look at it. Oh my God, it shows like... Uh, the molecules in his brain. Well, it kind of shows like <laughs> the person, but with a different shade when you look through it. All right, well, believe it or not, it's less. 1,210 calories. So everyone who chose less chose wisely. Replace it with your eyeball. I want to see Where what happens. Do you have that? Uh, that is on Eat This, Not That webpage. Eat okay, This, Not I'm That. I'm on Buffalo Wild Wings page themselves. Mm -hmm. They say it's 1630. Okay, well, Eat This, Not That says it's not. Maybe it's a different um, formula that you're looking at. Oh, there's a Fuma. Fuma. That's, that's fine. Go on, bud. Fuma. So this, we're, they're referencing a webpage called Eat This, Not That. Fuma. Eat This, Not That. And so you while yell you do at that, them. I will, I will confirm each one, but I'll let you know. Fair enough. Yeah, keep us honest. All right. How about an um, a IHOP Colorado omelet? An IHOP Colorado omelet. Is it more or less than 1,000 calories? Is an IHOP Colorado omelet more or less than 1,000 calories? I say a little more. I say it's a little more because. How many eggs are in that omelet? However, the recipe would, would call for. Puma, can you make the uh, the lounge rain petals like this? A little All right. <laughs> well, this is a directly off the menu um, chef's recipe. All right, the answer is 1,250 calories. It's more. Now, JR, keep me honest on this. What do you got? I'm looking at IHOP's website. They say it's 1,260. 1,260, 10 calories off. Yep. All right, so there I mean, you go. It's better than the other one, but. Right on. All righty. Oh, but we're right. going by the numbers on Eat This, Not That. Eat This, Not That. If this, then that. All right, the next one, we're just going to do a couple more just for fun. Go for it. If this, then that. If this, then that. Eat this, not that. Eat this, okay. not that. Please hold. Please if hold. Scroll, if, if, I, if. All right. All right. The Cheesecake Factory Pasta Napolitina. Cheesecake fa Factory Pasta Napolitina. You know, I've never eaten at a Cheesecake Factory. Wow. So you've never had to experience their novel sized menu? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> All right. Is and it novel sized portions? Yeah. The Cheesecake Factory Pasta La Ponatina, is it more or less than 2,100 calories? More. Cheesecake Pasta Napolatina, oh, more or less oh, than 2,100 calories? That's not KP, that's point. Close enough. <laughs> KP point, same thing. Yeah, KP's not on camera at the moment. Yeah, he's in the other room making dinner. KP's he's, he's cooking. cooking. He's making us dinner, bitch. What do you call that thing again? <laughs> Did you feel that? Got thunder? Yeah. All right, here we go. All right, well, the answer is for the cheesecake. Factory Pasta Napolitina actually is 2,480 calories. It's more. I told you. Oh my gosh. It is a. If you want to get fat fast, you go check out that 2,480 calorie cheesecake pastry. Eat that twice a day. Right. Yes, yes. Look, uh, start eating that twice a, uh, three times a day, please. Right on. And uh, we're gonna make you huggable. 
It's already hot. Okay. Oh, All right. You. More hot dogs on no. the menu. Last yes, one. Last, last one. Oh. Here we go. The Chili's oh, restaurant. The yeah. Chili's restaurant. Crispy honey chipotle and waffles. Crispy honey chipotle and waffles. That just sounds like 400 calories. 4,000 right. calories to me. Is it more or less than 290 calories? And it is, by the way, the highest calorie item on this webpage. Yeah, it's definitely 4,000 calories. Probably is it more or less than 2,900 calories? It is the most calorie induced food that this webpage can find. We're about to get drunk on pancakes. <laughs> We're about to get. <laughs> All right, here we go. The answer is 2,590 calories. It's actually less, but Jeepers Crow, it's still 2,590 calories. 2,590 freaking calories. You have blown away your entire daily caloric intake. You can't have nothing else. And what was that? But water. That was the Chili's Crispy Honey Chipotle and Waffles. Wow. That's a fancy way of saying chicken and waffles. Insanity. I wonder, yeah, that actually reminds me. I wonder if the chicken and waffles at, um, oh, what the hell is it called? Uh, <laughs> That's a lot of calories. Ca ca uh, Hash House of Go-Go. Have you ever been there? No, I've not. It's really good. Oh, their chicken and waffles is amazing. <laughs> but it's still not as much as an entire pepperoni pizza. No. So all of you who have eaten that entire pepperoni pizza, remember, you've done 3,880 calories. <laughs> you've done some damage. And we've all done it. I think we've all done it. No, so, I think I did. You will do it tonight. We're going to make an order of your large pizza. <laughs> if you do help, go whatever case you time down. Like, eat it. Eat it. Eat it. Oh, you don't have to time me down. Eat stuff, man. I eat all the time. We'll get the funnel. <laughs> we'll get the funnel. All right. All right. So there you go. So we're going to come back and have some more fun with our with our lounge. If you're not lying. Oh, God. Who are they? Everybody's blue otters. Oh, oh my gosh, it must smell terrible in there. Oh, I know. It, it smells, smells like fish. <laughs> Lots of fish. <laughs> Everybody smells like fish. <laughs> oh god, the otters have taken over. <laughs> I have to admit, I've been watching a lot of otter videos lately. As you, long as you guys You too? Everybody. Everybody in here is an otter. What the hell? As long as you guys don't bring this place into outer space. Otter space. Oh, Boots Boots is like, okay, we'll go up here. Uh, Boots. No, it's Boots with the hose! He's going to go under there. <laughs> yeah, he's trying to get up the stairs. It's hard to climb the stairs with all this heavy... How come you two aren't otters? No! No! Well, well, why not? I believe, uh, you know, Ray was crippled by cuteness. And as you can see here, he's just kind of in pieces. And oh my god, that'd be more weird. So, and then I saw this, you know. Safe outfit. <laughs> <laughs> Ray's is bogey. He's a pretzel! We might have to make uh, boots. Uh, a boots mm -hmm. otter. Like, have the same outfit and orange and have all the same pop pattern and put on an otter. As long as it has a very sharp vest, that'd be fine. Mm -hmm. that, that, that'd be okay. So. What? What? Wait, 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 what are you taking away? Food to cost me food. But for today, well, you can do it on a switch now. Yeah, you can do it on. Oh, look, that looks like really that. on a switch. I yeah. knew about the uh, the can PC you... or the, the, the Steam. Oh, the Steam thing. Okay, yeah, we got it. Oh, looks like a switch. Secret. Secret. Secret's been in the browser the whole night. Yeah, secret. I know. But secret. Hey, my friend, are you by any chance ready to do a little uh, furry card sharks? Yes, I am. <gasps> you furry, sure are. Furry, furry card Oh my oh, God! Let's, let's go find a, clo a quiet corner. This is going to be a real treat, upstairs. everybody. Go upstairs. All Quiet. eyes on Secret because he's got a fun game for all of us to play. Secret, follow Yappy. Okay. Thank you so much, Secret. The last time you did this, it was a real treat, and we thank you for doing this again. Uh -huh. And Secret, I will have the uh, the mat the yes. match game. Edited for next week. I found out what oh, the pro cool. I found out what the problem with mm -hmm. the original video was, and I've corrected it. Yeah. So now I'm re-editing uh -huh. it so that like the audio okay. and everything is synced. 
So next oh, neat. next week all right, thanks, thanks we'll so much, have. KP. You're, no, okay, thank you for helping all right. set all that up and for Tyson no. helping set all that up. Thank you, Tyson. But yeah, we'll we'll do that next week. So all your you can tell all your friends. We'll be airing it on the show next week. And thank you, Closet Fox, for all those wonderful presents. It's like Christmas already. Christmas? With Closet Fox yeah, Santa. Closet Fox. You know, it's, 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 hey, like Chris, you, Fox. it's like Christmas every day, but it's not because we're on the Fun Day Paw Pet Show. Yay! Oh, my God. Yes. That was yes. damn good. That was yes. damn good. Was that you, KP? Yeah, yeah, that was me. Wow. That's what I was like. <laughs> you did a really good Closet <laughs> Fox. Oh, look, because it's like, Yay. hello. I was oh, was oh, look, I'm, I'm over here behind secret, so you can't see me. I'm in my... Secret uh -huh. hiding space. Do the oh really, do the really high uh, hello. <laughs> hello. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> wow. That's that actually good. really good. That's not Toxie oh. doing it. Hold on. Wait no, a closet. Oh. That's not Toxie. That's KP. No, he says, it. is that good Toxie? Oh, hold on. Uh, if good Toxie's. Yeah, that was good that Toxie, Toxie doing it. Yeah. Oh, that was good Toxie. <laughs> so, hold on. So, uh, secret. I need you to just nod your head to what I'm gonna say, so it'll sound yeah. like good Toxie's coming out of your. Okay. Just start nodding, so it'll look like you're talking. Well, hello, everyone. I'm in my secret hiding space. Yeah. Like, why do we even need Shut them? up! So, <laughs> so <laughs> everyone, you want to watch the Fun Day Pop Pet Show? I'm going to punch you. Watch the Fun Day Pop Pet Show, because from the secret hiding space is going to come Closet Fox and <laughs> Super Good Toxie. Yay! That's perfect. Oh, my God. That is a very impressive <laughs> Closet Fox. <laughs> oh, it hurt my throat a little bit to do it, but... Okay, so you got to do your game. All right, Secret, yeah, it's all yours, man. Let's do it, Take it away, okay. Secret. All right. Okay, thank you, Yappy and, and my crew. Uh, we're going we're gonna to play a little bit of uh, an, an element of furry card trick. We're going to do the survey questions. Okay. Uh, I I love the cards in, in another world, but uh, but uh, we'll play but we'll play a few uh, a few survey questions and they're all based on surveys of 100 furry fans mm -hmm. uh, from from Twitter and Fur Affinity and and just uh, all over the furry all over the furryverse, and uh, and uh, we'll uh, let's see. Well, I was, I was hoping we might uh, get uh, somebody from uh, from down. To, uh, you know what we can do? The, the us, way that we can do us. way that we can do this secret, we can actually have someone here in the <clears> studio <throat> answer the question, and then we can put down the A right. or B floor if Fuma wants to set the yes. A and the B floor up, and A will be lower than the guess of the person in the studio. And B will B be higher. Will be higher. That way we can get everybody in the Chaos Lounge involved. Yeah. Oh, nice! We so go. we got to get Yappy back here to do that. Well, if Fuma can... Or Fuma. Oh, there, Fuma look, did it. Never mind. There Fuma it got it set up. Thank you, Fuma. We love you. Okay. There it is. So, uh, we got it. Yep. So, Secret, Yay. you might want to move a little bit. Uh, when you're looking at the at Yappy, move a little mm. bit. There you go. So that way we can see it. And we'll let Mutt... I think we can move our camera a bit. When, when Yappy gets back. When Yappy gets back. Um, mm -hmm. But, Secret, go ahead and ask your first question, and we'll let Mutt okay. guess the numeric answer. Okay. All right. All right, Mutt, here is question number one for tonight. We asked 100 furry fans, do you have a character that is not a mammal? How many furry fans said they do? Okay, have a we need to look at the floor. Not a mammal. Yeah, we need to look we at need, the floor. To so, Mutt, how many furries have a character, furry character, that is not a mammal? Okay, and this is a percentage, or is no, this a... out of 100. Out of 100. How many... Yeah, I mean, it's basically a percentage. That's not a mammal. So it'd be like a reptile, a bird, snakes, um... Hmm. I'm going to say 20%. You're going to say 20%? Mm-hmm. I think mammals are pretty damn popular. So, for the floor... Now, does that include, like, the fictitious... Eared Dra character. Well, like, like a dragon would be not a mammal. Like, but uh, silver down there, um, that is basically it's a mammal. It looks like it looks like it's a mammal. It's a fantasy mammal, but it's a mammal. If it's got paws, it's a mammal. If if, if it if it if it's young, drink milk. That's the way we'll do it. Because well, it, it, it's got yeah. paws or hooves, it's yeah. a mammal. I think that's pretty yeah. safe. Okay, so Mutt says 20% yeah. have a non-mammal character. It, do you all think in the room a Lower than twenty percent, or B, higher than twenty percent. Okay, lower or higher than twenty percent. Um, I would say B. And if you think it is exactly twenty percent, you stand on the line. Oh, and Shy Matz is here. Shy, did you see our, our paw uh, foot little salute for you earlier? You did. Okay. Okay. So it looks like more. <laughs> yes. Actually, it looks like it's pretty evenly split. Might be a little heavier on the B side, but all mm -hmm. right. Well, secret. It, it's Why don't you tell okay. us? Okay. 
Well, the actual number of furry fans who said that they have a character that is not a mammal is... 37! 37! 37 percent! The bees like boots. There you go. Neat. Ba 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 boots. Ba ba ba. Ba 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 boots. He's got it. Now so does um shortcake's got it. And Bungie's got it. Sofer's got it. Fur Demon's got it. John John Hall of course has got it. Shy has got it. All right. Well let's have another one. And this time we'll let Simba. Let Simba guess. Okay. Oh goodness. Your yes. question, Simba, mm -hmm. is this. We asked 100 furry fans, have you ever attended a furry convention? How many furry fans said they have attended a convention? 62 and a half. Uh, you think 62 percent? Yes. Yeah, yeah, out of 62 out of 100. And a half. Now, if you think Simba is dead on, then you would stay on the line. But if you think it's lower than 62, go to A. If you think it's higher than 62, go to B. All right. Yeah. What do you think about this um, Twitch Shad, chat? We're not meeting in line here. I, I feel like oh, that now. What? All right. There you go. See. So, Wait, when was this question asked? <laughs> this was asked within the last like three months. <laughs> Oh, okay, good. Okay, good. This is very recent. It. Oh. So it looks like the vast majority yeah, are saying and, it's and, higher. And, 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 all right, now, yeah, now is, Zorro. Is, have you ever attended a furry Hold on. Ever, ever, ever. In, our, in, it doesn't matter. in the um, Twitch chat, Zorro says 70%. Or did you already mention that? Well, 62% is the guess. We're guess right. Everybody is just trying to guess, is it higher right. or lower? Now, did you read the Twitch chat? Mm -hmm. oh. No, I, okay. I can't see. Zorro says 70%. Um, so you saying hi? Also, and that's the only person who guessed. All right. Oh. Okay. Never mind. <laughs> so, <laughs> so, so secret. Uh, oh, Matt Wolfwood says B. Yeah. Secret. What is the actual number of furry fans that have actually attended a furry convention? Okay. The actual number of furry fans who said that they have attended a furry convention is 71. So B, everyone on B. Ba 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 B. Ba 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 B. Who's the sheep? Yeah. Yeah. It's a chubby sheep. Okay. Now, now, secret. You, we're going to let you ask the next question to Yappy Fox, the starter of this show. Okay. What would, what would Yappy's question be? <laughs> okay, Yappy, this time we surveyed 100 con-goers, and we asked them, at furry conventions, where do you sleep more often, in a bed or on the floor? How many con-goers said they sleep more often on the floor? More often on the floor. How many? I, I would say probably 20%. 20% of 100 said they've slept yeah, on the 20. floor. Now, Chaos Lounge, if you believe more than 20% sleep on the floor at furry conventions, stand on B. <laughs> if you believe the number is smaller, stand on A. Mm. There you go. See, I'm shorter than you now. Okay, right. we shorter than you now. So where did the bathtub <laughs> lie? <laughs> That's the floor. All right, so Alfie <laughs> says A. So basically, Matt Wolfwood bad. says A. Pack, uh, Pack Wolf also says A. So does Boots. Boots is not staying on Boots bu 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 Ah, 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 Well, we've all seen Boots sleep on the mm. floor. Furries are cheap. They're cheap. Oh, Boots refuses to sleep in the bed. It looks, like we, have bed. A, it looks oh. like we have a pretty good idea of who's who's thinking if what. If they only knew about the athlete's feet that's all over those hotel room floors. Secret? What's the answer? You don't want to be on those floors, people. <laughs> uh, I might be uh, fetish. Oh, now you tell me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a floor person myself, uh, but the actual number of congors who said they, they sleep more often on the floor is seven. Seven? seven. Wow. Seven. 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 Oh, it is way lower. Please get this one. They don't want to get their fur suits. All right. Yeah, there's a lot of vomit and urine and poo poo on those carpets. Yeah. The secret. The next question is going to be asked to Toxie. Uh -huh. Okay. Uh, uh, which one? Oh, the 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 the, the, the real Toxie. Okay. Which one? What do you mean, which one? Okay, real Toxie. <laughs> okay, real Toxie. We asked 100 furry fans. Have you ever visited? A Disney theme park. How many furry fans said they have visited a Disney theme park? I'd probably say 30 Because it's, I guess it's the one that's a lifetime experience. But at the same time, Disney has such a huge All right, so if Toxie has said 30% have, <coughs> have visited a Disney theme park. 
If you believe the answer is lower, stay on A. If you believe that the answer is higher, step on B. More than less than 30 of 100 visited a Disney theme park. All right, Shy says more. Um, oh, who's I'm, our, who's and our, I'm, I'm gonna say more. I can't make that. Dingo Foxy. Yes. Dashing Fox. Dashing Fox says more. Silver says more. Bungie yeah. says less. Chanel says less. It looks like more people are Rhino. saying more people are saying more this time around. Rhino, the later birthday boy this week on Friday. Says now, yes. is this from our Twitch chat? All right, and our Twitch chat says um, Mafida says higher. Beach Bears says less. Um, Pack Wolf says, "What's a bed?" I guess he only sleeps on the floor. And Otakon says more. He he says B. And anyone else? Um, now this is a, now this is the this is the Disney theme park question. I'm so, sorry. Oh, did I just go back into the bed? Yes. I'm sorry. The theme parks. Yes. More or less. Sorry. 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 Shut up. It's okay. It's okay. Tired. So secret. What do you? What 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 was the actual answer? Okay, the actual number of Ferret fans in our survey group who said that they have visited a Disney theme park is 57. Okay. 57%. 57 has visited higher. a Disney Mine's theme park. 57%. Much higher. Cool. Good stuff. So good job, people that, that went to B. How about how many have visited one? So the bees win that one. Bees. All right, secret. We're going to go back to Mutt. The bees. We're going to have Mutt answer. I'm going to give it a go. Okay. See what happens. What about a bet? All right, Mutt. Okay, Mutt. Even better. Okay, this question went to 100 non suitors. These are people who have never worn a fursuit. Okay, this we includes them, partials. Do you want? Or do you want to wear a fursuit someday? All right. How many non-suitors said, yes, they do? How many non-suitors said, yes, they want to wear a fursuit someday? So what do you think, Mutt? What's your, what's your numeric answer out of 100? I'm going to say 75 out of 100 said they wanted to wear a fursuit someday. So he said, Mutt says 75. Actually, no, wear a fursuit someday? I'm going to go higher. I, I changed my mind. I'm gonna do 90. Yeah. 90. 90. Wear a fursuit someday. That could just be a one-time okay, deal, 90. once and done, just to try it. But I'm gonna say mm -hmm. 90. Now, if you believe the answer is lower than 90 percent, stand on A. If you believe the answer is still higher than 90 percent, stand on B. 90. Now there are some people that are really struggling with this one. I'm seeing people like they're doing the dance. Yeah, that's the major. They're like just dying in heat. I think I think a lot of them want to try it. I think a lot of them would like to give it a one-time shot, and that's what that would count. Hmm. Whoever stand on the line gets it. Gets what? Yeah. All right. So they, they think you got it on the snoot. <laughs> well, the actual number of not suitors who said that that someday they want to wear a fur suit is. 82. 82. 82 so it was a little low. It was a little bit lower. A little bit lower than 90, <laughs> but not by much. <laughs> Boots is perfect. Record. Boots is perfect. Record has his streak has been ended. It's Boots with the hose. I shouldn't have changed it. I'm so sorry, Boots. All right, so let's let's go back to Simba. <laughs> I believe me. Let's go back to Simba. Secret, you have a question for Simba. Everything else. Yes, I do, Simba. Right. We asked 100 furry fans, do you usually sleep with a stuffed animal? I think that 40 furry fans said that they do. 40? 40. Now, is it has ever or no? No, no, that they currently do. Currently sleep with a stuffed animal. Okay. Yeah, actually, probably way less. Do body pillows yes. count as a stuffed animal? Yeah. The pillows with the little prints on it? Yeah. Dikos? Dikos? Yeah, I would say those are probably a yes because. It, because it has a face on it. It's yeah, okay, there you go. So there you go. That includes daikus. All right. We now, if, you believe, if, you, if you believe the number is lower than 40, say A. If you believe the number is higher, say B. So just belched. Yep. All right, Bloopster says more. Um, you know what? I'm going to say more as well. Ferg Demon says less. I have seen quite a few people... That do sleep with stuffed animals, either go to cons or not. So I'm gonna say higher. Bubba Boots is staying with Bubba B. I'm with you, Boots. I think it's higher. Um, Fuma says less. All right. 
And in our chat, Thank Alfie you. says oh, more, Odegon says more, Beach Bear yeah. says less. <laughs> Matt Wolfwood. Thank you. I'm sorry. Um, Alfie says higher, so and Mephitis too. says lower, yeah. uh, and there you go. So there's our answer. So, so secret, mm -hmm. what is the actual answer? All right. Yeah. I, well, the actual number of furry fans who said that they usually sleep with a stuffed animal is 45. So oh, slightly oh. higher. You are wow. Very close. close. Very close. All right. So bu 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 <laughs> All right, we're gonna do a couple more, and then we, I think we have a, an interview or something. Oh we just had a we had a lion poke his head in here. So a lion Ooh, interview. Yeah. So mm -hmm. let let's go to Yappy again. Okay. Let's go to Yappy and ask Yappy a question. Okay. Okay. The, oh, this one's this one's gonna be right up Yappy's alley. Uh oh. Okay. <laughs> okay. okay. Alley. Congoers. Alley. Oh. <laughs> One hundred congoers. At furry conventions, are you more of an early bird oh or a night owl? Oh boy. Oh. How many congoers oh. are early birds? How many are early birds? I'm gonna say maybe only ten percent are early birds. Ten percent. He's gonna say ten early birds. percent. How many people do you actually see up early at a con? Now, do you think that the answer is higher than ten? Who's going? To that free me, breakfast. But if you think the answer is even lower, than oh yeah, it would change if there's free breakfast. But if it's if it's pay it's, breakfast, it's just in general. Yeah. <laughs> if it's lower than 10%, stay on A. If stand on A. If you think it's higher than 10%, stand on B. Uh, yeah. Beach Bear says uh, define early bird. Anything before like 10 a.m. Yeah. Anything before 10. <laughs> anything before 10 a.m. <laughs> Yeah, it looks like most people are, are either on the line or going to be. Mephita says less. Mm -hmm. Zoro says more. Tichal says less. Although some of these people might think 2 p.m. is early. Yeah, <laughs> because they're up until 2 a.m. Beach Bear says more. Oh, no, the true night owls are the ones that are going to take advantage of the, of the uh, free breakfast. And then go to bed. Yeah, and then <laughs> Carista is right on the money. And Zoro says, does not sleeping count? Yes. Oh, wait. I don't well, it's sleep. But let's, uh, let's find out. Secret, what, what's the answer? Oh, yeah. Okay, the actual number of con <coughs> excuse me. Bless you. The actual number of congoers who said that that, at, that when they're at conventions they're, they are early birds is 46. 46. Wow. Oh, I don't believe it. Nice. I don't believe it. Yeah, they're lying. They're, they're probably saying early is noon. Yeah, they're lying. <laughs> it's called full of doo doo. All right, well, we're going to have one more question by Toxie. Yeah, it's before 4 o'clock in the afternoon. We have one more for original Toxie. For birthday boy Toxie, original Toxie. This one, this one, this one, this one, I think this one is just serendipitous. For birthday Toxie. Okay. We asked 100 furry fans. When creating a new online account, have you ever had to use a different username because your first choice was already taken? Oh! I lost my first choice. Yes, they have. All right. You lost your original name because it was already taken. Toxie, how many people do you think said, yeah, I had to choose something different because somebody sniped my name? I'd say probably 30%. 30%. It's Toxie's guess. Yes. They lost because it was already taken. Now, if you think it's lower than 30%, stand on A. If you think it's even higher, stand on B. All right, lower on A, higher on B. All right, Beach Bear says it's higher, so does Carista. Odegon says it's higher, and so does Matt Wolfwood. Um, Pack Wolf also says higher. You had to change your name because your name was already taken online. So, was the survey conducted early in the morning? <laughs> All right, Chris is Define early in the morning. <laughs> <laughs> All right, looks like most of, most of the people in the Chaos Lounge are saying B. Yeah, okay, we got a couple. Fuma thinks it's a little less. And uh, so is Laura. All right. All right. All right. Well, the actual number of furry fans who said that they have had to choose a different username because their first choice was already taken is 76. Wow. 76 percent. I love the way Boots' face just lights up when he realizes he got the right answer. Boots, is it time for you to celebrate? Let's show us your celebratory dance, Boots. Yeah. Up, 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 B. A lot of times when you go to update your, uh, your Steam account to a uh, the user account, Who? Uh, or like when you're setting up on the website, 
It All right. Makes you Matt Wolfwood hand. says he's aced it. He got every single one right. Awesome. Congratulations, Luke, Matt Wolfwright. Like Matt Wolfwright. Oh, and let's see. And also in the, also in the chat, Carista was only two off. Nice. Oh, okay. At seventy eight. Nah, hey, Floofster. Like Good to nice. see you, sir. It's my birth. Shut up. Your birthday, what? too? Happy birthday. birthday. We're going to do the birthday song. <gasps> this is it's your birthday, birthday song. song. It isn't very, very long, long. Floofster. Everybody sang for Floofster. No one sang for Floofster. That is right. <laughs> you know what? It's also my birthday. No, it isn't. Oh, that's right. No, it's <laughs> mine. Good, Good taxi. No, this no. is your birthday song. No. It isn't very long. Oh, thank you, everybody. I'm going to go win. Happy birthday, Ploofster. I do not want anybody singing. Do you want to share your age today or no? I guess that's you don't have to share your age if you don't. Twenty two. Twenty two years on Earth. Congratulations. Well, here's to 150 more years. Yes. Let's go. The boots with the hose. The boots with the hose. Yeah, that's what I call it. The hey. boots with the hose I and all John Wallaby, I see a Chanel. Getting low, 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 low. And yes, sh and, and Shy appreciated all of the, the, the foot uh, salutes. The foot salutes earlier. I believe you can I'm glad you guys liked my you know, something, something I think that would be really fun, yes, we, if, if we could do it. Uh, Yappy was doing the Joe Boxer song earlier. If we could do that, could we see all of our folks in the Chaos Lounge dance to the Joe Boxer song? Just do their own little... Yeah, Joe Boxer yeah, dance. Do you want to do that? Does everyone know how to do the Joe Boxer? If not, they just dance however they want to. Because it's a little short. It's a teeny little short. Are you hungry, right? Yeah. Bank select two. Everybody? All right, here we go. Everyone do the Joe Boxer underpants dance. Go. Come on, let's see you dance. I want to see you Do that Joe Boxer underpants dance. Look at Secret Joe. Secret is rocking it. He's crushing it back there. Everybody. Oh, my Silver's doing a good job. Uh, I, see, I see the dragon. All right, Ploopster's doing a good job. Yeah. Look at Shortcake go. Wow, this is the Baloo's back there. Oh, he's doing it. He's totally nailing it. Okay, <laughs> Lothrak, stop. you got to hurt someone. Oh, Bungie Skunk's twerking to it. Uh, and look at Boots. Look at Boots. He's like, uh-huh. i got to get my tail into it. Okay. Fuma's doing a good job. Yeah. All right, Boots, good job doing it. Dashing nice. Foxy. Dashing is 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 just cutting it apart. And if you guys are really enjoying your dance, do a little jump in your dance. Jump oh, look, around a little bit. Look at the dance that is. Who's that? Who's the, who's the blue one? He's doing a good job. Something husky. Azure husky. Uh -huh. Azure husky. We gotta make friends with look him. Friend Betterhead. We don't. We're not friends with you yet. We gotta get friends. Where did friend go? Oh no, you mean that one? Down. Yeah. Look at that shot. Oh, I, I sent a re friend request. Oh, he's dissing us. Yeah. Oh, he's shadowing us. He's ghosting us, rather. All right. Because we would love to host a game with him later, if he's available. But we've got an interview to do. Yes. We have a special guest in the house, all the way from Parts Unknown. Yep, so we'll be getting ready to go to Studio PQNC. <laughs> this is funny. I am loving it. Fred Betterhead, you guys, how are you doing it? I don't know. But Look at those moves. Those we, are just... You guys are just, you guys are so happy and so energetic. You're awesome. He's smashing he's his back. he's breaking his skull. Secret is just uh, secret is is making me smile. <laughs> <laughs> I cannot stop. Hey, smiling. John Hall is slashing it in half. Look at that. Oh my gosh, John! Do you think you can dance? I think you can dance. I'm I'm impressed with John Hall. I don't know, I think he's winning it. Oh, Shy's doing a nice little jig. He's doing a nice calm mellow. Champion. Okay, well, Rhino's doing a great job. Yeah, I'm very is. impressed. Everybody's doing awesome. You're all getting your steps in. Yep. All right, 9 o'clock. It is time for interview time. Interview time. I think he's ready yet. Oh, he's not ready yet. Never mind. Okay. Abruptly we'll stop. Keep dancing. Go. Look at Fuma. We'll, we'll stall. Look at Fuma jumping around. Look at that. He's super otter. Oh, oh, now you gotta no. do it on ice. Now, now Fuma's gonna make it all into <laughs> Fuma. a floor. Fuma's a jerk. Oh, he just put ice under everybody. Now they're all gonna fall and crack their head. Oh, look at Fred. That's okay. Damn, we got a concussion. They got plenty of ice. 
And two boots fell down. Oh, boots, it's okay. Ah, <laughs> oh, poor boots. Boots, it's all right. Oh, no. Dance on ambulance. your back. Do a back dance. Ambulance. Instead of a backstroke, do make, a back dance. Make a snow angel. All right, he's fine. He healed. Oh, good oh, job. He's, he's doing jumps and leaps and backflips. We hope everyone's having a good time tonight. Thanks for joining us on Fun Day. This is the time when the Chaos Lounge is actually the best part of the show. <laughs> Bungie's doing the, you guys are the stars. Lux over there. All right, we're going to need some questions. Everyone get some questions in your brain for our Mios. buddy Mios, because he's got the answers, but only if we know what to ask. He will give you wisdom. He will give you knowledge. OK, now you got to do your game for in here, because we're like at the end of the show. Oh my god, now this week's flew in by. Flew in by? Is that a word? Flown. Flown. Is it flung by? It flew by or it's flown by. All right, everyone in the cast lounge, we are time we are time for talking right now and talking hard to do. It is time for us to play the final game of the night. That's right. Never have I ever. So get that football field down. And these are questions that you all came up with in our Discord. And it is time to put everybody, you all to the test. Everybody move over to the starting line real quick. Be sure and uh, throw a lot of questions down during the week for the show. Have one person that's stuck between 9 and 10. If you would like to move, please do. If, if There we go. You're awake now. And it is. Uh, we don't have to be safe for work at these hours. So if you want to ask a question that's, a, that's not for people at work, because I don't think anyone's at work right now. That doesn't matter. Uh, you know what I mean? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. See? Yeah. 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 I'm going, All right. I'm going up to the bananas. Did I? Hopefully I dropped bananas down last week. I don't know what the bananas are. Well, the bananas kind of separate last week's question from oh. this week's question, okay. so I don't uh, ask the same question twice. And I don't think I did. Wait a minute. I know how I can do this. Last week's show number was 21, so I did. Wow, we got a lot of questions coming in. Well, let's, let's get to it. Quick. All right. Dipper asks, never have I ever... Stayed up all night long. If you've ever stayed up all night long till the sun comes up, done it. Step forward. Been there, done it. Many Got the bags under my eyes. I did it last night. Party all night. Rock and roll all night. Party every day. Oh, this is a nice song. It's yep. cute. All right. What's yeah, the next like one? one? Uh, let's see. Pocket Duck says, "Never have I ever caught a fish." Have you ever gone fishing? I have caught a fish. You caught a fish on your own, all by a, yourself. It was a perch. I wonder where that fish could be. And I've also caught a crab. And I was caught scared. Caught crabs? I, That's I not... caught a crab, and I was oh. so scared of it, I dropped the reel, and it flew right back into the ocean. Oh, okay. Oh, no. Actually flew into the Gulf of Mexico. And I want to ask if they've had crabs, but I don't think it's appropriate. <laughs> oh, it's probably be an embarrassing one. If you've ever ridden on a motorcycle, Never have I ever ridden on have a motorcycle. You've not driven a motorcycle, but Rid ridden on, like Rid hide, hugging behind somebody. Yes. Or if you've ever like been the passenger car. or a sidecar, mm -hmm. not the driver of a motorcycle, step forward. We all know the proper term for it, but we're not going to say it. What is it? I want to know. Running oh, biatch. What is it? Riding, Riding biatch. Riding bitch. Biatch. Riding biatch. Oh, biatch. There you go. All right. Next question, Mutt. <laughs> Uh, never have I ever, this is from Otakon Magoo, never have I ever had a celebrity crush growing up. Oh, have you ever crushed on a celebrity? That will include a cartoon because of our immediate clientele. Yes, but this I is did. fine. If you like Robin Hood Mud or something even like knows, that. even knows who my first crush was because oh, he I got do. me to take a picture with her. This is true. Joyce DeWitt mm -hmm. from Three's Company. I crushed on her so hard before I knew anything about myself. I was just like, she is so pretty. I just want to go up there and give her a kiss. Um, Fuma asks, never have I ever walked along a railroad track. Have you ever walked along a railroad track? Step forward. I have. Many times. Yeah. You ever get killed? Have you ever put a penny on a railroad track to crush it? <clears throat> if you've ever put a penny on a railroad track to crush it, step forward. I'm surprised. Oh, somebody did. Oh, uh, Ferdy even has. Ferdy even has. Okay. Okay. Um, let's see now. Dipper asked. Mm -hmm. Right. Uh, that's a really trivial one. Got to pass on that one. Um, Next one. Mm, some of these are really, right. really well, I'll, specific. Well, you're finding one. Okay. Never have I ever skipped stones along in, in the water. If you've skipped stones in water. All right. Fuma asks, never have I ever identified yourself as a furry to a coworker. Have you ever told your coworkers that you were furry? Followed by probably a really long yeah. definition. 
When I work with Simba, I was like, hey, dude. You yeah, identified me as a furry to one of my Please customers. define it after you Did explain I? it. Don't let him jump to conclusions. I don't even remember that. No, I don't remember doing <laughs> Um. Oh, okay. Never have I ever finished a game of Monopoly, also from Fuma. I have finished a game of Monopoly. <laughs> All the way to the end. Oh, Finish yep. that game of Monopoly. Ooh, we got a race going here. Fuma also asks, Never have I ever worn an analog watch. Have you ever worn a watch that was not battery operated? Well, no, not digital. Digital? An an analog has hands. Analog has hands. Oh, so it can be battery operated. Yes. Okay, yeah. just has hands. Um, never have I ever carved your initials into a tree. Have you ever carved your initials into a tree? Using the power of the sun. I, I have. I still have the name plaque that you did for me. <laughs> that. He used a magnifying glass, carved my name. No, into that's a carved into wood. wood. We're talking know, carved saying, into a tree. I'm just saying he's done that for me. But no, I've never done it with a tree. Uh, Fuma also asked, never have I ever attended a dinner theater show. Have you ever been to a dinner theater show? Yep. Like um, uh, Medieval Times. Medieval Times. All right, Salute. we have two winners. I had Salute, the, the mystery dinner. All right, Scout has and Fur Demon has. We're going to see who gets the second and third prize. Okay. Dipper asks, never have I ever been to a drive-in movie. Have you ever been to yep. a drive-in movie? In a camper. There was a whole bunch of us. In there. A lot of people have. Okay, we got some more winner winners. Two more second All right, place. we have Rias and Boots has got a second place, as well as John Hall. All right, who's going to get the third one here? Um, Fur Fuma asks, never have I ever had a goth or a punk phase. Did you ever have a goth or a punk phase? Where's that black lipstick? Never, I did not. All right, we Never. had a couple. Azuru and the evil potato has. All right, there's our first, second, and third place winners. Everyone, back to the start line. We got more. We got more. We're not we done more. yet. Get back to that start line. We're going to find out more about each other. Run, run, run. <laughs> quick, 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 quick. Run, 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 run. All right, All right, next one. Never have I ever been in, not seen or looked at, but in the cockpit of an airplane. Have you ever been in the cockpit of an airplane? Nice. I remember I have. All right. Oh, the first plane I was ever in, I was in the cockpit. I even flew the Same thing. here. I even got the little wings from United. All right. Never have I ever been in a motion picture. Extra. Have you been in, in a speaking feature role. film? If you've ever been in a motion picture in any capacity, step forward. I have. Yeah. I kind of have. I was a random zombie. I was a fursuiter. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, Fuma asks, never have I ever beaten a video game on its hardest difficulty. Beaten a video game on its hardest difficulty. I have not. I play it in normal, and then I'm sick of it. I did it on the I Atari have. 2600 on difficulty level, which was set, setting B or A. What's one of those? I did it with Space Invaders. And then it went Pfft. All right. Next question, Mutt. Pickles asks, never have I ever scalped something to sell it on eBay. Bought it at a discount, sold it for more than we paid for it on eBay. Bought it I just bought to sell it. On eBay. You bought it with the specific intention to sell it on eBay, which is fine. Which is fine. People Tell me why fine. I got that out the line. All right, Odegamagu says, never have I ever argued with my parents for being wrong about something. I'm confused on that one. We're going to dis disregard that one. That's, that's a difficult one to understand. Um, never have I ever. Never have I ever been on a construction site. Some of these get really. If you've ever been on a construction site, a building going up, step forward. Okay. Fuma asks, never have I ever installed Linux. Have you ever installed Linux? I have not installed Linux. <laughs> I've lost count installed. the number of times I've done that. I've hundreds. Done that many times. Hundreds of times. <laughs> uh, Dusky asks, never have I ever changed the brakes on my own car. Have you ever changed your own brakes on your own car? Did that last January. Ooh, John Hall has. He's Boots has. Stuff. Boots has. I've done like 10 brake jobs. He's done a lot of brake jobs. Okay. Dipper no. asks, never have I ever played a drinking game. Have you ever played a drinking King, game? King's Cup. Do that every week. King's every week. <laughs> we got a boots in the first place going here. Let's see if he can hold that lead. Yep, another question. Dusky says, never have I ever purchased a fidget spinner. Did you ever purchase a fidget spinner? Fidget not a gift. Not a gift, not found. I did. 
But purchased shame boots? Why do you have... You no, you don't have to have shame. <laughs> no, I love mine. There's no shame. Mine is like weighted. They're very satisfying. No, that's fine. Uh, let's see. Do you have another one? Well, let's see. Dusky says, never have I ever been stung by a bee. Have you ever been oh. stung by a bee? Yep, and a hornet. <laughs> All right, oh, we're getting close. Many fire ants. Many fire ants, yeah. <laughs> never have I ever bought a silly light-up toy from a carnival, fair, or theme park. Bought one or won one? Yeah. Bought one. Bought one. Hours of fun. That's what we used to one call it. One of those spinning things. A thing no. that just spins oh. lights and doesn't do anything. We've got a three-way tie here. Yeah, All right, never. Are fun. It doesn't last a whole day. Fuma says, "Never have I ever typed an entire email in all caps." Have you ever typed an entire email in all caps? John Hall has. Scout has. All right, we're gonna find out who's the second and third place winners. All right, how about this one? Never have I ever bought a Disney pin, like a pin trading Disney I pin. I bought my first one just yesterday. Oh, there he is. Okay, Boots has. Ryze has, right. Dashing Fox has. All right, let's get one more from our right. from our from our uh, Twitch channel. Or, uh, or from our. Look, I'm scrolling on Discord. down here. Never have I ever been blocked by someone. Ooh, have you ever Ooh. been blocked by someone? So many times. So so yeah. many times. I have, and I still don't know why. Same. We have winner winner chicken dinners. All right, so we have some third place winners just cross the line, I take it? Was that the case? All right, you want to do one more? Yep, yeah, we can do one, one. Yes, we can. We can do one more. Okay. Everybody. All right, one more. Really quick. Third time's a charm. Back to the start. Back to the we start can do right. this. We can do it. We can do it. You can do it. I believe in all of you. Run, 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 run. <laughs> He's running up the stairs. Come yeah. on down. Come on, jump, 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 jump. You can do it. Jump. Yay. <laughs> all right. No. Let's start this up. one. This one's kind of gross. He's on a bungee never, cord. Never have I ever clogged a toilet. I've done that. If you've ever clogged a with toilet. doo doo. Not yeah. with toilet paper. Just doo doo a, alone. I'm not going to ask with what. I'm just saying if you've ever clogged a toilet where it had to be plunged, step forward. Yes. We're not going to ask any questions about why or how. Maybe. All right. Next question. What? All right. Um, and Simba, you be thinking of one. Oh, I'm not good. <laughs> That's why I'm giving Dipper, you, uh, giving you Dipper opportunity. Dipper says, never have I ever seen a chat channel edited live. You're looking at the chat channel and you see it being edited. You see messages being spell fixed or words being taken out yep. or just a whole sentence deleted. Been there, done that. You've watched it happen right in front of your eyes and you're like, wow, it's like magic. All right. And this one's going to be pretty specific. It deals with the Pop Pet Show. Mm -hmm. Never have I ever heard one of Oni Kadoo's original songs. Ooh, Oni knows how to put together. Now, Oni is a musician. If he you've heard one of Oni's yes. songs, step forward. I want, I want them to listen to while I work. <laughs> you should and, just stream some. And Oni was like shocked show. that I asked that question. He was like, yeah. what? I was like, what? You should do a streaming show. Uh -huh. I, would totally, I would totally tune into your streaming show. <laughs> um, Secret says, never have I ever <laughs> immediately regretted something I said online. Ever say something and completely regret it after you said it. In yeah. other words, you're not perfect like everyone else on the planet. Yeah, I did. Several times. Of course I have. <coughs> but some of them... You I say it even... and then it doesn't sound the same in your head. No, sometimes I say it and I don't realize what it was I actually said. Sometimes it'll sound different in my head, but when I type it out, it's like, wow, it sounds completely backwards. Well, no, for me, I was like, I was trying to say one thing, but the words I chose were inappropriate. And I didn't know they were inappropriate until after I saw them on the screen. Yeah, I'll be like, in my head, I'm like, would you like to go to dinner? But then I type it out, and it's like, screw you, Toxie, you suck. And I, I don't know how it gets translated out like that. It's just right. so weird. Okay. Um, Fuma asks, never one. have I ever put a cartoon, or wait, a carton of ice cream in the microwave for softening it up? Have you ever put in microwave in the uh, uh, ice cream in the microwave to soften it up before you ate it? I love soft ice cream like it's uh, a shake. I love it soft. I do not like it hard. I'm a soft ice cream man. All right. All right. Never have I ever eaten more than one steak. You've been to a steakhouse and you ate your steak and you're like, I, I gotta have more. And you order another one. <laughs> Most I've ever had myself was three. I feel like this is targeted. No, have, no, seriously, I've actually done this. And this is another question from the from the channel, but it is something we asked earlier. But I'll ask it again. Never have I ever eaten a whole can of Pringles. If you've eaten a whole can of Pringles, if you're that guy, step forward. We've done it all. 
We have the shame. Okay. There's one. Yeah. Never have I ever had a job that I enjoyed going going to. Like, Ooh, you went to work and you just loved it. Yeah. Oh, okay. A lot of people. Nothing wrong with this. All right, Dipper wants to know. Dipper says, never have I ever driven a golf cart. Have you ever driven a golf cart? Step forward. Or Pargo. He crashed one. All right, Fred, what is it? What is it, Fred? If you've ever called Oni cute, step forward. Okay, who am I? Who am I beating now? Just Fred. Step forward. It's just Fred. Don't worry. No one else thinks you're cute. You're good. You're good. No one else thinks you're cute. All right. Never have I ever eaten poutine. Have you ever eaten poutine? You don't have to have liked it. You can like it or not like it, but you've at least eaten it once. Okay. Poutine or poutine? Poutine. Poutine. French fries with cheese poutine. curds. Poutine. Why are you always in the Something gutter there, different. Fred? I've never eaten poutine. I've never, right. I've never eaten Here's another one for you guys. Never have I ever rescued a dog. You adopted a rescue dog. And killed it. No, you adopted a rescue dog. And we have a winner. I think. We have a winner. We do. We do have a winner. I, it, Over on the right. Oh, he just showed up. Never mind. Never mind. We have a winner yet. Yeah, okay. No, he's okay. just standing there. Um. Ajax says, "Never have I ever visited an actual haunted house. Not a theme park or a, a haunt, but a real haunted house." Ooh, we've got, we got four winners. people crossing the line. We got Baloo. We got Dashing John Hall and Fur Demon. Well, Fur Demon's probably the haunter of the house. <laughs> All right. Never have I ever taken... Second place, never have I ever, for Fuma, never have I ever traced over someone art, someone's art. Have you ever traced over someone's art? Step forward if you have. I have. It's a practice. You practice. Yeah, yeah I, I practice yeah, doing it. I just, I've like, done it. Get that. Oh, no. All right, John Wallaby says, never have I ever cooked fish in a microwave. You ever cooked fish in a microwave? This is for the third place winners. Look at that. All right, there's all of our first, second, and third place winners. Ladies and gentlemen, this has been our game, Never Have I Ever. Thank We've you so all much gotten to learn a little bit about each other. Clappity, clappity, clap. Oh, so clapping. You still have your you guys, look, everybody. Oh, looks like everybody. Oh, say cheese, say cheese. Everybody, we're taking our picture. Right. It's picture time. Say cheese, everybody. John Hall, front center. John Hall, front center. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, there. there you go. Chick, chick. Big cheeses. Chick, chick. Boots, turn around. We don't want to your, your teeth. We need to see you. Yay, boots. <laughs> boots. <laughs> Yay, boots. <laughs> Wonderful going <laughs> 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 All right. Not that bad. Don Hall staring did, did at us. Did Coaster just walk in? Coaster, where were you all night? Yeah. Maybe. I just got back from Philadelphia like five minutes ago. All right, tell us all about it. You got two minutes. You got, you, you got you got four minutes to tell us four about it. Four minutes to give us your report. Go. Give us all the gossip. What? Four minutes. What? You have four minutes. From the con? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Well, was it, was, it, was, it, was, it, was a blast. Uh, they had a little bit of issues with uh, registration, uh, but other than that, it was a good, I had a good time. Standard. What's your favorite memory? Uh, the, 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 uh, hanging out with all my friends. Hanging out. New ones. I met a couple new Did you, new, did, new did you do a dance? So great. Did you go to one of the dances? Fox and Boots. Yeah. I did. I did. I did the Friday night dance and got nice. up on stage. Did you buy anything? Did you buy anything out of the dealer's room? Uh, yeah, a couple of things. I bought a print, uh, uh -huh. some stickers. Uh, did you get any new artwork made? Yeah. Uh, no, I did not. You did not. Okay. Did you try any new food somewhere? Con's gonna be so much better. So I don't know. Oh, mm -hmm. yes. not really. Okay. Uh, um, did you get laid? I didn't. I didn't really. Uh, what? I'm asking. Someone put a lay on you. What? Oh, I'm sorry. I think we got a bad. Didn't, my, didn't, my, my didn't have time for that. My, my, Nobody got time for that. You gotta make Nobody time for that. that. No. Did you get drunk? <laughs> No. No, you did not get drunk. Okay. Hello. Uh, did you um, overheat at all? <laughs> get overheat. You know, I think I stressed myself out a little bit on on Saturday where I went too long without taking the head off. Yeah. All right. And I kind of crashed.
Saturday night, didn't do anything. Like, I could do the dances on Saturday night, but didn't do so because I was just too tired. That's okay. Look, as long as you had a good time. Did you get enough sleep? Six, did you six, two, one? Mostly yes. Mostly yes. Mostly yes. Okay, got it. And is there anything that you... They had the... My knee. Is there anything you regret? Yeah, they had the... Um, I wish I could have stayed longer, but I had to get, to get, to get this in. It was nice. I, I, the, since I live, in D, I live near D.C., I can take the, I can take the Northeast Regional down to Philly because the hotel is in, down, is in Center City, Philly, uh -huh. which is like 10 blocks away from... Away from oh! It. You know what? You might be able to help us out. <laughs> Mutt and I are going to drive up through D.C. to visit, like, Smithsonian. Maybe you can give us some pointers on where you, uh, mm -hmm. hotels we should stay at that aren't like DC rape, but are close enough to let's say take public transit into. <laughs> no, we're okay with normal rape, just not the DC yeah, I, rape. <laughs> yeah, uh, I, de I definitely. Rape? Be. Stay with I'll, I'll yeah, talk to you about that. Too. Alexandria. Yeah, hotels okay. in Alexandria. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Rape uh, yeah you probably want to deal with the, probably towards the end end of the blue line or the orange line or the silver line. And, and yeah, we'll talk. I love all those colors. I don't know what you're saying, but we'll, I love all those we'll colors. We'll talk so because we don't we don't want to have to park in DC necessarily, and we don't want to stay in a hotel in DC either. So. Oh, so, cool beans. We'll talk later. What's going on in here? Sibber's staring at the screen. Sibber's watching. <laughs> Sibber's watching Coaster. Now we're watching Sibber watching Coaster watching Sibber. And then Sibber turned around. He's like, what? <laughs> and share the show with a friend. We want our show to be, you know, to be a lot of friends, not the randoms. We'd rather not go to, like, random start advertising places and all these rando people show up and they start being douchebags. We'd rather be friends with friends, so go ahead and share it with your friends, bring them on in, we'll all have fun together. How's that sound? So, and don't forget, next week, our amazing uh, buddy Dipper will be here with Stargazer, not here, but he's gonna be um, zooming in. So we're gonna have Dipper and Stargazer and he's gonna tell us a lot more about those special stories, those audio books that he does. We're gonna call them audio books because that's basically what they are. And if you get a chance to cook for some friends, get together. Have a fun dinner with your friends this week. Be social. It'll be fun. Labor Day. We have Monday off. Yeah, a lot of people are, are wanting. A lot of people are wanting to hang out. So if you can spend some time with your friends, not tomorrow. Do so. No, the next Monday. No, next Monday. Okay. okay. Um, once again, happy birthday, Toxie, and good Toxie. Happy birthday, Toxie. And also happy birthday, Rhino on Friday. Rhino Wolf on Friday. And uh, someone else's birthday popped up. I forget who it was. And but it, Simba. Is Simba's got a birthday coming BJ up. BJ Buttons is going to be at Simba's later this month. Yeah, yeah MFM 25 so. next week. And MFM 25 years. KP and JR's birthday are going to be in October, so get those presents ready. And that's it. Mine's in September, so. What's 25 years? MFM. Okay. Yay, MFM. Congratulations. Any um, going away words? No. No, got nothing. Okay. Good night, everyone. Good show. Good wait, time. Wait for the run out. <laughs> Good night, Wonder Dog.